don't really see this as a new development. Uh, traffic volumes have always increased every year. There's, there's really nothing new here. So end users buy internet subscriptions and use them to access whatever content they want. That is by design. Now it's secured through the EU net neutrality regulation from 2015, which says that ISPs or telcos cannot interfere with the choice of services by, by end users. Mm -hmm. um, we use more and more online services in part because online plays a greater and greater role in our lives. And this is really a business opportunity for, for telcos um, because on these online services create demands for faster internet access services. Everybody needs an internet access service these days. If we only use the internet for email or filing tax returns, we would go for a cheap mobile subscription with a low prepaid data volume. That would suffice. But we don't. We want Netflix. We want high definition video streaming. We want social media, video conferencing, uh, perhaps one day the, uh, the metaverse. And all of that creates end user demand for high speed internet access services. And this is the market actually works. Uh, in Denmark, my, my own country, Fiber-based networks are now outnumber cable TV networks mm -hmm. for high-speed internet access. Even those about investing in a new infrastructure rather than using the existing one for, for, for cable TV. Mm -hmm. 